Um, <clears throat> I want to bring up an issue um, relative to tonight's hearings. Uh, we have a email, basically, a um, form that was sent by the uh, town clerk relative to tonight's hearings and the posting thereof. So, uh, first of all, to explain, that's the first sheet you have on in front of you tonight. I'm the only one with that. Well, I'm the only one with that? I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, from Laura Gary, it has been brought to my attention that there was an error in the posting of tonight's ZBA meeting. The agenda was submitted on time and posted in the book in front of the town clerk's window. The event was posted on the website on time, but somehow the agenda did not get attached to the event. The agenda was attached to the event a few minutes ago, which was earlier. Uh, not sure where the issue lies. Uh, clearly an error. Technically, for a meeting to be considered posted correctly within 48 hours of the event, and the agenda must be online as well as the agenda in the, in the book. Therefore, there could be some question as to whether this meeting was posted on time or correctly. It is up to the ZBA to decide how to move forward tonight's meeting. Feel free to contact me with any questions or concerns. So I'm going to ask the board um, how it feels. The individuals uh, that we have that tonight are three continuations um, that we have moved forward. I know that, well, I'll ask Kristen, all the individuals for tonight's three hearings um, have been notified and they were are well aware of it. Correct? That the hearing is tonight? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yep. Um, and anybody who has been here for the hearings in the past has also been here. Um, actually, I don't see any new faces. <laughs> um, subject to the individual hearing, so I'm going to ask the board what your feelings are. Um, Mine is that um, I, I would think that we are safe going forward. If these were brand new hearings, I would have a concern. But these being continuances, I don't. Robert? Uh, even though they're continuances, I, I have the gut feeling that uh, if they weren't properly advertised, that we would be uh, in violation of, of, of public hearing law then. Uh, so I, I would say we shouldn't probably go ahead. Okay. Sorry? Is it the legal opinion for that memo that we yeah. have the authority to move Town forward in this situation? Is ZBA has the authority to decide? Correct. Okay. Frankly, I don't have a problem with continuing tonight. Uh, town Council's yeah. wrote in our court. Everyone's here, everyone knows about it. Well, actually, Town Council has not. Uh, the town Clerk is thrown Town Clerk. Town Clerk. Town Clerk. Yeah. Well, that might be different then. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I, I, I thought that we were talking about Town Council in the, uh, in the email. <coughs> I, I think that if, if that's not the case, and it's, and, you know, I guess where it's up to us, I would err on the side of caution with Bob and say, if there's a potential procedural defect, I don't know that you can, you can move forward with that. I mean, I'd like to. It seems reasonable to. But, you know, if you were going to, you're potentially going to have to, I mean, I don't, know, I don't even know what the consequence of that would be. I don't know if you have to reopen them from the beginning and have them yeah. refile. Um, I believe we would pick up, um, if there was an issue, we would have to go back to erase whatever was done tonight and re repost the hearings again. Um, no charge to the applicants, but we would have to pick it up as if it were a new continuance and just extend it forward. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I would think, you know, it obviously would be enormously inconvenient not to have the hearing tonight, but if you were to postpone it to our next regular meeting, assuming that there were slots for that, that would be faster than having to backpedal and undo and, uh, you know, 
rework a decision that we had made, you know, potentially an error. Those are just my thoughts. I don't actually know the answer off the top of my head. Okay. Nick? Well, I think odds are that um, anyone interested in these cases would have been here from the, from the beginning, since these are all continuances. And the odds are probably if we were to have this meeting tonight, no one would object. But I think it is a violation of the open meeting law to not post the agenda. And I'm also not sure we have the discretion to decide um, whether we should move forward or not. So I would err on the side of caution and um, probably postpone it. I, I can just add some background experience to what could be the extreme dilemma. And I don't think that these merit this potential reality. But I've seen other uh, projects that I've worked on itself that because someone declared that they were not properly informed are now in court holding up a job suing the ZBA for just an improper notification. That's all the details I'll give for that aspect. That is how far it could go. I don't believe that these are any objections since we're just trying to push it on down anyways. It's not like we're trying to pass anything. Um, but erring on that side of caution and maybe thinking of the next time slot, is there a way to review the issues now so that as a board we're well aware of the points? so that the next time here we can just do the proper formality of passing this? Would that be possible to help expedite a process? No. Fair In enough. my mind, no. I'm going to ask a man who's <laughs> been involved for a long time mm -hmm. and said many a cases. So, Mark, what are your thoughts? <laughs> <laughs> um, I think if you open it, you open up the can of worms, potentially. And if, and if you decided to, to open it and continue, and then there is a problem, you ended up back at square one where you would be if you continue it to next month anyway. So you're not, you're not really gaining any time. Uh, another option we would have, um, seeing that uh, I think the majority of the board members would like to um, not have the hearings this evening, um, do we know what's posted next Wednesday for this room? We do Because we already have three hearings for the six. Mm. And one of our members who sat the three previous hearings will not be here, right. so we'll already be down to four. So we're talking about potentially postponing this for a month. Yeah, June 5th. Is there? Um, there are two on for June fifth, potentially two for June nineteenth. I I don't think that's a, a bad idea at all, John. If, if in fact the board could make it uh, to do it next Wednesday, if in fact the applicants could make it, I think that's what you have to check. But. Uh, no, I, I think you have heard the board members, and uh, that, that's what I would say. I, I would caution. I, I don't think it would make the state attorney general very happy if something would need. You know, if something came up, a decision we made tonight, and it went to the attorney general's attention, I don't think they would be too happy about it. Right, maybe this is a case study for somebody else to bring back. Well, mm -hmm. you were lenient then. Why aren't you now? Mm -hmm or whatever in the case, bias of some sort, but I think it does open up that prospect. That's why there is regulations to be upheld to, mm -hmm. as disappointing as that can be, I understand. Um, is there any way to check, Kristen, to see um, what's on the calendar for next Wednesday? I can run back to my desk and see. Yeah. That would be great. Thank you. In between, you might want to pull it, so I want the uh, applicant to already shoot in the head that they couldn't attend. Possible that they switch over to jo John, it might be possible, too, if, if they'd be willing to split. If there's two for the 5th and two for the 19th, you might be able to get one on each if they're willing to compromise to mm -hmm. that. Yep. I'm just thinking of scheduling one of them, at least portion of it, right. for next Wednesday night if we can. Jenny. 
Uh, Mr. Chairman, thank you, Virginia Adams. I'm interested in the Azalea Circle property, and I don't see any of the proponents here for that. Um, can you get enlighten us why they're not here? Um, K Street development. I think uh, I can't. I can't. I can't get into it except to say I have a letter from them. Okay. Um, heard it, there might be something happening. So. That has been, as you know, postponed three times. Right. Mm -hmm. um, and I do have a letter in front of me on that one, so you can draw your own conclusions. <laughs> and, and I, I think Is that a public record now? <laughs> uh, technically, it's it still sits. Technically, it still sits in the folder until we can open this this hearing. And if we can't open the hearing tonight, it can't go any further. Um, well, there's there's an issue with that particular case too. Okay. So I I, I hate to if we're gonna <laughs> get into that. Yeah. Yeah. Hello. So you're shaking your head, so I, I couldn't do next week. So I have another hearing on the twenty second. So um, the next meeting would be the sixth. June sixth. Sixth. Fifth. Fifth. It sounds open. Fifth and the nineteenth, and I better than the nineteenth. Here the fifth, but other people have sat in on it. <coughs> I'll throw another monkey wrench into the hopper here. I will not be available next Wednesday. <coughs> Next okay. Wednesday, you have to get the other five guys to make sure they're here. Yeah. That's, that's uh, two weeks, right? That's only two weeks. I don't know if there's anything for this room, but I would have to double check to make sure. Is that short? Let's say this room might be open. Three weeks. Um, yeah. Up to the library. If, if, I'm sure we can find a location. It's, we had to. If we had to, so um, so Burger King is not going to be able to meet. Um, what about uh, Winter Street? We'd be available next Wednesday. Next week would be okay for you. Yeah. Um, I'm sure that we could do Azalea Circle uh, next week too. So we could do the two of them next week. Mm -hmm. Post post tomorrow. Yeah. So. Um, you're not here. Will you be, you'll be here? Mm -hmm. Next week? Here. Yeah. Yes, I could be here. Yeah, Nick? Here. I could be here. Okay, so we'll have a full board, five members who were here earlier on both cases. You set, you reset the, let me put the burger jack. Um, the winter street is new. The rules we'll probably we'll we'll sitting we'll on, on, well, it's just, I think, a continuation. <coughs> of, when this was first opened up, <coughs> I had a Bible was sitting on that. Well, yeah. this, yeah. yeah. Um, but it's just a continuation. Mm -hmm. Well, the first year of this continuation, too. It was the first, the first time. You never got to open anything up. No. Except the hearing itself. Yeah. So we'll hear Winter Street and we'll hear Azalea Circle yeah. next Wednesday. Okay. And Burger King um, will hear on the June the fifth. And you're not here on the fifth. So I'm, I'm not here, so you, uh, yeah, Craig would have to hold in my stead. Uh, Kyle, were you here for that? For the Azalea? Right. Oh no, no, for Burger King. No, that's still the one I mentioned I was not part of. Nick, you were here. I was here. You were here, and you are here. Okay, so that's four of us. Um, would you be willing to go back and look at the tape? Oh, sure, certainly. We can do that. Um, oh, interesting. And I'll tell you what you're going to find. Um, you were just in there one time. Correct. And then we continued. Yeah. So it's, it's a... Just a continuance for that. I can coordinate that with Kristen. Yes, if you would. Um, if you could coordinate that with Kristen. Uh, sign the appropriate documents. 
for the Mullen rule. Okay. And we'll go forward on that. Okay. So um, I will take a motion for adjournment for tonight's hearing, uh, postponing it to. Um, well, this is even a continuation. It's a postponement, basically. Of correct. This is right. Postponement. Yeah. The whole meeting is postponed. Yeah. <coughs> Doing that, uh, since we are here, I'll take a motion on that. The postponement. I'll go ahead and make a, make a motion that we adjourn tonight's meeting uh, based on the town clerk's uh, memorandum uh, received by the chair tonight. In the movement of in the in the postponement of the of two of the cases tonight, Winter Street and Azalea Circle. Right, as Winter Street and Azalea Circle, which is case number nineteen zero dash one, and uh, case number. Uh, 19, I'm sorry, did I say 0 1? Oh, yeah. yeah, I did. 1901. And uh, Winter Street, 12 Winter Street, which is case number 1908 to, uh, let's see, today is the 15 7, would be 22nd to May 22nd uh, in the Selectman's meeting room, unless we hear otherwise. Mm -hmm. have a second on that? Second. All in favor? Six zero zero. Because you will be sick. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I thank everybody for coming. Uh, unfortunately, uh, this I can't remember this happening in my okay. years. I can't yeah, remember I this. Say, I, I, I get. It. I'm embarrassed over the, you know, yeah. on behalf of the town. Uh, now. So, are you going to repost it? Yes, it will be posted. It will be posted tomorrow. It, it, yeah, on, on the it website, won't it probably won't be published, uh, Virginia, but it oh, will okay. be posted yeah. on the town website okay. 48 hours prior to the meeting. I think it will be done tomorrow, probably. But. And that's an acceptable way now. You don't always have to have it in the. Uh, Apparently, the state likes to like call it versus the, uh, yeah. the paper posted in the town halls. We only post the first initial. If it's, it's a continuance, so we don't put that in the paper. Right? No, but because it's postponed, right. uh, we need to. It's just like if it were a snowstorm. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Now, do we need to render a continuance on uh, Burger King? I we think. Have, we haven't done that yet. 1907. Okay. To. Uh, June fifth, you said yes. Uh, let me make them. Uh, Go ahead. I'll make a motion then. In that particular case, because of uh, the issues tonight, that we uh, postpone uh, the hearing on uh, ZBA case number nineteen zero seven, three fifty seven Main Street, Burger King, to June fifth, two thousand nineteen. We have a second. Second. All in favor? Six zero zero. Okay. Now I'm okay. Now that's so the one I won't be at is, is the June. Right. Yeah. I'm gonna stay and talk to Mark for a minute. Um, thank you again for coming. Uh, we apologize. Uh, Are you going to do any other further business this evening? <laughs> no. We're moved to adjourn. But Jenny, don't go away. I have a question for you. Um, I'll accept the motion. Well, well actually, it's, it's not an adjournment because we didn't open a hearing. So right. All we, we've done is close it down for the night. So, so, so we did. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I guess you can just this could be a wall. No, sure. Yeah, yeah.